Don't know why there's no sun up in the sky. Stormy weather since mom and I ain't together. Keeps raining all the time. Why is it raining outside? Jakarta has been raining like the whole February, I think. Gosh, I hate this kind of weather. Welcome to another video. It's me, Tara. Today I have a fitting of my first bespoke suit and I'm super excited about it. And I'm just gonna start getting ready as usual. Taking my uh, LA Girls Pro Concealer and Chestnut to contour my face. It's been like raining since January. It was raining during the new year. Because of the rain, there was so much flood going on in Jakarta. There was a lot of like unexpected flooding around Jakarta. A lot of people's houses got flooded. I'm like, thank God I didn't, but wow. New year was not looking good for <laughs> Jakarta people. Oh my God, I don't have my brushes. Fine, I'm just gonna use the same contour brush to apply my foundation. I'm using the Born This Way, um, Too Faced Born This Way, natural beige can i focus okay stamp it on this is how i've been doing makeup lately applying contour and then stamping the foundation over it and the contour looks amazing so natural i think i got this technique from um scott barnes when i was watching tati's video <laughs> Huh. Give some tricks. I don't know why, like during the end of 2019, I got a lot of like random recommendation from YouTube um, about minimalism, no buy related video. I was like, what is happening? I've been always pretty curious about it, but never really looked into it because one of my aunt is kind of living that way but I never really asked how she started her um, no buy or minil minimalism lifestyle. I think it's pretty cool. We, we both love coffee and she always brings her own straw. And I always think that I should start doing it, but I never get uh, myself really to do it. I clicked on a video and then it turned into like, I couldn't stop watching all of those videos. Watching people's no buy experience and how they like how they slowly um, become minimalist. A lot of people shared that they have a shopping experience, over buying makeup and over buying skincare. When I first discovered YouTube, um, same thing happened to me. I thought I have to buy a lot of makeup, and until now, 2020. I still have like a lot of makeup that I haven't gone through and I'm the type of person that wears makeup every day and it's still not going out. I'm like, what is happening? But it never really hits me as you know, that is a really wasteful thing to do and I'm like wasting a lot of money on them too. I'm gonna set my contour with the ColourPop um, press powder contour. Some of the products have hit pan. I was so happy. I'm finally doing this. I'm not gonna drag them. I'm just gonna stamp it on. A little bit of swiping maybe over here. Okay, bring it up a little. From some blush. It's from Cezanne. Wait, yes, it's from Cezanne. It's number one. I've loved this since I bought it. Couldn't stop, couldn't stop. Can't stop, won't stop. Stamp it also. Little, little smile. A little bit on the forehead. A little bit on the nose. And now I'm gonna set my under eye. I'm gonna do it quick, maybe everyday kind of makeup. Uh, my powder is from Can Make. First, I swipe it. Ooh. 
take the shine out of my forehead. There we go. Uh, I'm using the I Love Makeup. This is the Revlon palette, I forgot. This is from my friend. Pina, if you're watching, I have two colors I already hit pan. I'm like, yes, progress. I like the brown here. It's like a cool, it, cool tone brown. I never really get used to using brow pencils or those kind of two-ended brow pencils to do my brows. I just don't know how. They always turn out really weird. I feel more comfortable using like these kind of brushes. There was a time that the Benefit brow stuff was pretty high and everyone trying to get that and I did. And I ended up getting the a pencil thin but I never really end up using. I like the color, it was like grayish black. But every time I draw my brows with that, something is wrong. They don't look as I want them to look. I just stopped grabbing that product, that thing, and sitting a long time in my makeup collection. But on the other hand, I have four foundation that I don't know when I'm gonna use it up. Slowly. Someday. Look even now? Do they look even now? Does my brow look even now? Uh, take a liner. I'm not gonna do any eyeshadows today. Keep it simple. Keep natural. I'm gonna take the Rimmel Scandal Eye 24 Hour Liner. And smudge it out. So I have on my lips the Milani uh, Amour Matte Lip Cream in the color Adorable, number 10. No, it doesn't focus. And I have my lips lined with the Rimmel Lip Pencil in Coffee Bean, number 4. Wait, I want to change my earrings. Ugh. I found a lot of uh, new earrings in the garage of my house that my mom left and I was like, wow. I can stop buying earrings because uh, these kind of these ones are so vintage it's a clip-on i'm like now it is so hard to find a clip-ons oh my god i forgot my uh, highlight so back to our minimalism topic i'm gonna put some highlights it's from anastasia beverly hills the amrezy amrezy one girl oh lord oh yes so I took some notes from a lot of people's video. I uh, I don't think that I can not really do a no buy yet. I'm not sure about that one right now. I'll try the low buy first. Yes, I have made myself an Excel um, sheet that I will calculate what how what is my my spendings and how much I spent on food, shopping, gifts. Divide that and yeah where my income go i'll have a little bit on my chin and on my nose my forehead okay maybe i'll update you guys somehow i have i think i spent a lot of money on eating out usually people like eat out once a month i can do it every week that's not good. I don't really buy clothes anymore after my mom passed away. She left a lot of stuff in the garage. I found a lot of stuff in the garage. So, so many clothing that I can't even wear. Some fits me. I'm really um, happy about that. I got some, a lot, I uh, got a lot of vintage clothing, but oh, that is, there's so much in the garage that I have like, I, I think I won't be able to use up all of them or wear all of them or other things. These are the things other than clothes in this life. So I seriously, I need to manage my life. Having a new job, I need to have some control. I need to have some control on my money. I'm turning 22 this year. Like Tara, I want to have control on my money, how I spend my money. 
and that was a really good idea because after like the minimal then no buy kind of videos there was a lot of financial videos that um uh, popped up on my uh recommended page it's like a reality slap thank god i didn't have any debts but i need to put my own money into good place into good use in 2020 i want to care about the environment more uh, my aunt is already like um, starting to plant uh, vegetables and stuff in her garden. I'm like, wow, she's in another level. She can compose her own trash at home. She has a space in her backyard that she can do that. Like, crazy. I want to do that gradually, baby steps. Reducing using plastic. I've stopped using um, body washes. So last week I just used up all of my body washes like from um, body, the body shop. They are pretty pricey and she recommended me some new stuff. She recommended me to use soap bar and she told me some like local brand that I can support uh, to buy my soap. I have some of it here I want to show you guys. I bought um, three. This is the two body soap. It's from Seven Cactus. One of it is the Sabun Kopi, uh, the coffee soap, and then the other one is Moringa, and the other one is the shampoo. It's the coconut mango shampoo. They come with papers inside. I'm like, Ooh, it smells so good. It is. It smells so damn good. I don't know what it is. It's like creamy mango coconut jammy soap <laughs> oh this is so good like even though when i didn't open the package yet i could i could already like smell it this is so good let's open the morning one. Ooh, whoa oh aesthetics look at that look at this aesthetics so good and the coffee one should look like these wow a cup of coffee in the middle pretty cool oh my god i can't wait to use all of this up i bought three i think they gave me a gift a big another big bar of soap it smells so great mm. usually these kind of like soap bars takes a long time to use it up I can save my money on that. Yeah, baby steps I'm gonna do in 2020. So let's see how we go. So thank you for watching today's video. I'll see you guys next time.